And we are back. Thanks for staying with us, people. Yes, this is the kitchen of the Wake Up Nigeria show. And with me is Chef Flora. Good morning. morning. It's always a delight to see you. Thank you. Okay, so this morning, she is taking us on a trip to Igbo land. And I am so excited because there are so many delicious Igbo delicacies, and I love all of them. As a matter of fact, I had one of them for dinner last night. But mm -hmm. hey, um, this morning, she's going to be making Oha soup. Oh, please. <laughs> please talk about the ingredients for our Oha uh, soup. We have a lot of uh, interesting uh, ingredients here. Okay. Um, I have my um, beef. Use any other meat. Okay. Soy or soy. And I have pepper. I have my pork. Okay. Uh, from oil, you can decide to use your uh, fresh burger. Make this very, if you have the time. Okay. Processes. Okay. So, but I, I choose to use my um, oil. Morning, I have my pork. Okay. okay. Uh, Fish. Okay. Uh, I have my ugly here. I okay. Meat. Okay. I have crayfish, but dry chili pepper, and I'm supporting it with uh, fresh Cameroon pepper, mm. onions. I have a uh, uzizza uh, leaf, leaf. Mm -hmm. and then I have a uh, achi. Hmm? I have. Oha. Uh, yes, I have Which one leaf. is oha achi? This is our. Uh, this is a uh, oha. Uh, oha leaf. leaf. Okay. And this, this is achi. Is, I decided to use. Uh, Young man, so. Ah, yes. okay. That's young, putting a use... twist to it. Yes, right. Use coco young flour. You can use the fresh one if you have the time to uh. blend it or use your mm. uh, water. To okay, so this it. is like making bitter leaves soup, but yeah, in an oha way. Yeah, just so leaves. we're using oha leaves. Yes. And that's the difference that's here. The difference, Ooh. Yeah. Why is there coincidence in tomorrow in this morning's <laughs> meal? Because I actually made bitter leaf soup earlier in the mm, week, right? Okay. And then for the first time, I actually tried the coco yam flour, and it actually gave the same results. Mm. Yes. It gives you the same results. But hey, I'm pretty excited about this morning's breakfast. We are making. Oh well, Chef Laura is actually. I'm just here to watch. <laughs> she is making. Or her mm. soup, and we have quite a spread of ingredients here that she'll be using. So yes, let's get yeah. cooking. Um, okay, this is the meat stock, right? Yes, the meat stock. Okay, uh, everything has been pre prepared for mm. some program, yeah. Otherwise, uh, immediately you finish boiling your meat, mm. just add all the uh, ingredients, beef just stock, add to it. The beef stock. You know, okay. there's no need if you already if you're just boiling your, uh, your, meat, your meat, okay. All you need to do is just to uh, add. Uh, the stock fish the stock and the fish, dry fish. The dry fish. Okay. And then you allow it to cook. Okay. Then you start adding mm. uh, one all the, the other ingredients. But the leaves go in the last. last. And then the kokoyam uh, thickness okay. goes in last. Okay. So then again, I would also like to ask, for the oha leaves, do you slice them? Or do you just, you know, um, break them into the soup? Yeah. Thank you so much for reminding me. Uh, we use our hands, and that's why I didn't even do it mm. on home. I just want us to see, see how it. Okay. Uh, we just tear it, mm. you know, with the hands, just tear it mm. you know, into little, little pieces, mm. just like this. You because don't the use idea is for the leaves to come off, come off like they, ha they have to be like in chunks. Yes, and then it doesn't allow it to be bitter. Uh, if you use oh, knife to slice really? it, then the soup will be bitter. You see why you should always tune into the show, guys, because there's always so much to learn. You know, I never had an idea. I just knew that the first time I saw someone make the soup or cook the soup, they did not chop the lid. It wasn't sliced. Yes. She just, you know, um, tore it into the, into the soup, right, like into, you know, shreds. And now I'm learning that when you slice it, it becomes bitter. Very interesting hack right there. Okay, so let's get our pots. If you're just joining us, people with me in the kitchen this morning, is Chef Flora, and she is making oha soup. What exactly are we having this oha soup with, anyways? Well, I didn't come with any, any swallow, morning, but if okay. you use any swallow of your choice, yeah, yeah, preferably, uh, 
yellow gari. Yellow gari, <laughs> right? Just goes perfectly well yes, with our hard yes, soup. So yes, any yes. soil of your choice. I love plantain flowers because it's yes, also yes. very healthy, yes, yes, yes. right? It's a healthy mm. option. Okay. okay. Uh, while we are getting things started here in the kitchen, pretty excited about this morning's meal. I hope you are as well. And if this is one recipe that you definitely like to try out, please let us know all our social media platforms at TVC Connect. With me in the kitchen right now is Chef Flora. And if you're just joining us, she is making Oha soup, right? Oha is soup is an evil delicacy. Yes. I've already got things started here in the kitchen. Um, so tell us what's happening, Chef Laura. Oh, Oha soup is ready, almost ready. Almost ready. Just so talk us through, you know, how okay, we started, so, where we are at right now. Okay, so we boiled inside our boiled meat. We okay. have uh, the stock there, a little water. We need a little. Uh, Water, you have to put enough water, not too much, mm. so that because it will take the uh, thickening not to be okay. To be, uh, mm. you need to be careful to... with the quantity of water you're working with, yes, yes because well. and then it shouldn't be too small so that it should just be too thick, okay. You know, so, be... you want to have like a good balance, not too thick, but not, not too, too thin yes. thing either, yes. just somewhere in between, yes. Great. So, um, I see that you yes. also used ogiri, yes. I know that ogiri is also um, an Igbo condiment that, you know, adds that local but really tasty flavor to your soups. And they are very healthy. They the, are packing the, on a lot of nutritional flavor. benefits. Yes, it gives, it gives it that local flavor. Good. Um, so now that I'm, um, because trust me, guys, the pomo, the beef, the stockfish, the dry fish, everything has properly cooked. And all the, this is practically soaked in all the ingredients. So what are we doing next? So the next thing is um, I'm adding the crayfish. Oh, crayfish, good. Once you have crayfish, oh, yeah. sometimes you don't even need too much of the much seasonings, more, yeah. especially also if you've used the ogiri. Uh, you don't yes, even need yes. too much of the seasoning and, cubes and as well. You use less salt. Very little salt. Because you yes. also want to be careful of your the sodium your sodium intake it's not good for your heart as well not good for your liver your kidneys doesn't as well. digest exactly you only need them in a very small quantity very, very little okay so i'm going to add the thickener mm, and the add aroma the little has the air. Beautiful. Butter and the leaves goes okay. in last so yeah so in here we have our cocoa yam flour yeah, already i've added water to make mm, it into just a dissolve, paste yeah into a yeah, paste so okay let's mix it together and we, if we add it, if it's too thick, then mm. we can just add a little water to little get the water. right consistency okay. that we need. So. All right. Mm, that looks good. Coming well together. If you're wondering what the cocoa yam flour does, it actually acts yeah. as a thickener. A thickener. And it also right. uh, is a healthy flour. Yeah. So very, very healthy. Yeah. So that's why I prefer this instead mm. of achi. Achi. Oh, great. Because of its health benefits. Yes. Because cocoyam is also really healthy as well. Yes. Right. Yes. Okay. Do you need help with anything? No, I just need uh, water. Oh, okay. Sorry. So I'm just going to stare this. Okay, so you can see what nice I'm stare. saying that it's already picking. Yeah, it's already picking. It's too yeah, so thick. we need to add like a little, a more, little water. more water. Okay. Yes. Okay. So I'm just going to stir yes. it a little more. This so has soup. Is packing on so much, guys. For every um, for everyone that you take in, you're taking in either kumo or beef or stockfish or dry fish. It's got everything in here, and we also have yellow pepper in here as well to you know give it that extra flavor. That looks good. Is this yes, okay? Yeah. We are, we've gotten yes. the consistency that we yes. need. Great. So we're just gonna let it cook for a while. Why then? Uh -huh. add the Okay, so we're almost the leaves, what leaves are we working with? You want to tell us again? Okay, so we have uh, the Oha leaf here. Okay. Then we have the Uzuza leaf. Uzuza leaf. Yes, all to combine the mm. flavor. Because they each... nutritional value yeah. is very high. Yes, really yes. high. Because, I mean, Oha on its own also has, like, its own flavor that it gives to the soup. And then Uziza. Uziza leaves. Mm. Uh, this actually is, is called, uh, this Uziza leaf is gotten from, uh, like, those tiny, tiny black peppers. Mm. You know, I call it mm -hmm. So the yere leaf is, yeah. the, is the one that we call, we call mm. it. Uzuzali but it's popularly Nusuba. known as uziza leaf. Yeah, uziza leaf. I yes. actually really love yes. uziza leaf, most especially because it has a lot of health 
nutritional benefits. Most importantly, we all know that vegetables are very good. And when you're cooking with them, you don't need to leave, you don't need to leave them in no, no, no. heat for too long, yeah. right? So you want to get the best out of your in. veggies. Last. Last. Right, and you just leave it for so once the veggies go in, how long are you leaving it for before you take it out? A few seconds, just for a few seconds because you still want to get the it's freshness still, yes. from the your green. leaves. What we need is the green color, mm -hmm. that's the vitality that we need exactly. on a daily basis. On a daily basis. That's what They're packing on vitamins, guys, yes. and you do not want to play on that one. All right, um, our, our hot soup is getting ready, things are getting pretty, pretty sorted here in the kitchen. Pretty excited about this morning's recipe because I love Igbo deli cases, guys. Okay, Chef Laura, well done. Yeah. Well done. That's uh, it's no longer uh, Igbo. Uh, yeah. Dish is now uh, well accepted. It's well accepted. Okay, okay. great, great. So okay, enjoy. guys, uh, we're going on a quick break now. But hey, stay with us. I can mm -hmm. be the one sitting on that chair. Mm. You should actually, you actually, actually, because she so, won't. <laughs> see, the taller you are, the more exhausted you get after the kind of torture you put. Wow, in. interesting. So I think I deserve it. Plus, this is from my part of town. I don't know if MM can stomach No, this is Oha. And, uh, Oha soup. It's from... The Western part, okay, Chef yeah. Kato, where is it? It's from everywhere. It's, mm. from, it's, it's from everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 it's actually an evil delicacy. Yes. Is it? It is, actually. Mm, Delta is hey, Delta. Delta is evil. It's evil. Anyways, yes, Chef Flora. And this morning, she's made for us oha soup. Mm. But um, she used bitter leaf, uh, sorry, cocoa yam, yam flour as a thickener. For, as a thickener. Cocoa so, yam. Yes. So my wife uses, uh, some people use gari. We had a, a lady the other day who used gari. Mm -hmm. My I wife uses cocoa yam. My mother uses that little tiny BD, CD thing. Mm -hmm. What do they call it? Achi. That's what uh, she it's not achi, actually. Achi is also, when you put it in the in the water, mm. it dissolves. Mm. But it's also a thick Yeah, 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 yeah. That's mm. it. Mm. Okay. All right, try it, try it, try it. Yeah. So I, I, don't, I don't like swallowing. Mm. I just prepare soup. soup. Okay. Just the way it is. So, may I? Eat. Yes. Eat. This is one of plain gaming. Eat. <laughs> <laughs> but, well, this is one soup you can oh. have with any swallow at all. It depends on mm, how you mm, like mm, it. Mm, mm. Here we go. How far your diet? Out the window. <laughs> yeah, but it's actually healthy because it also has veggies, vegetables in it that's packing on nutritional benefits. You see, we have at 7 a.m. in the morning. At 7 a.m. in the morning. Well. It's good. It's so good. <laughs>